I think it's fairly straightforward to diagnose dementia itself, which really reflects an impairment that's progressive in somebody's memory and other thinking functions that affects their everyday activities. The more difficult process is to determine what sort of dementia somebody has. Ideally, there would be a quick blood test whereby we would tell whether somebody had Alzheimer's disease or Lewy body disease. Unfortunately, that doesn't yet exist, and we have to rely on bringing together various bits of information from a clinical history, an examination, memory tests, brain imaging, etc., to arrive at a best possible diagnosis.